Welcome to Extra Throttle House. I'm Thomas. And I'm James. And this is an LC500. It is. Thomas Did we been... need to review it again? No, not at all. Well, it's changed. <laughs> For 2024, we got some crazy updates. Yeah. Visually, doesn't look any different. Right. Except this one is in the new ultrasonic blue. Yeah, but other than that, engine? Mechanically the same. 471 horsepower, naturally aspirated yeah. V8. Yeah, all the rear stuff. Rear wheel drive. Uh, there's also another color, Copper Crest. Copper Crest. Copper Crest. Copper Crest, that's a cool yeah. name. Available to you about $130,000 Canadian. We'll chuck the US price in the air. We have sort of had a bit of a love affair with this car ever since we first drove it. Uh, and we did some fancy shots with rain and black and white because we've got romantic about it. It's one of those few cars out there you sort of do get romantic about, especially with this ridiculously gorgeous two-tone interior. Okay, I, listen, I want to say something. I would never buy this in a convertible ever. Wrong. Right? No, 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 it's not wrong because it already is a retired dentist's car. And then you take the roof off. Yeah. And it's like the final boss retired dentist. <laughs> but he's, right? a, he's a relaxed man who knows what he wants. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. That, he's had all the time in the world to figure out. he has a lot of money. How much money? Not enough to buy a Bentley Continental. No. This is a. This it simulates that. It simulates that for a third of the price. Yes. It's really quite pretty. I would just get the I would get the hard top. No, last time we had this, we had it in green with brown interior. It was a tree. It was a tree, and it was a beautiful tree at that. Why are you going to the driving side? I was going to drive. <laughs> You're not driving. Why not? I thought like we at least need to do a little. Uh... What? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Rock paper. Oh. This is extra throttle oh, house, okay. right? We just do All a right, little bit. Come on over, and we'll finish this. I'm not coming over until you finish the sentence. Rock, paper, scissors. Okay. You started it. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. Wait, wait, how are we doing it? It's rock, paper, scissors, shoot. And then we'll shoot. do it. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I, I win every time. I don't know if you know this. This is, this is old yeah. extra throttle host, but I, I have never lost. Get your brain, get your brain, get your brain. Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors, scissors shoot. shoot. If I lost, I was going to say we were playing for the passenger side, but. Judas. Uh, <laughs> Judas. <laughs> All right, start okay. it up, Ooh. start it up. Yeah. <laughs> yes. It's a Lexus. It's just crazy. It, I forget every single time. Just, like, just get on the road, I want to oh, hear no, it. I'm worried that I'm going to get chilly. So I'm going to open my little thing here. No, not that one. Click that. Okay. What does that do? It gives me the ability to. With this new screen, I'd like new to point screen. out, yes. Heated steering wheel, heated yeah. seats, heated neck scarf. Oh, I want my neck scarf on. Oh, full blast, yeah, please. Yeah, the logic's a bit strange, because it's one. One is three. And then three. And then two is two. Yeah, and then one. And then three is one. Yeah, look. Right, well, uh, three. Straight to three. Yeah. No, that makes perfect sense. What are you talking about? Didn't do that before. No, I want, I want to start full. OK. Here we go. All right, let's just get it out of the way. This new screen is great. It's, it's modernized it. It's fine. It's fantastic. It's all, it's, that's we, it. We've lost the touchpad here that Which sort is good. of flicked yeah. your finger back to tell you that you'd pressed it. <laughs> yeah, that's it right. Felt, it almost felt like a, a low intensity static shot. It's actually irrelevant compared to just how good the engine is. Like, none of this matters, honestly. I just well, don't we're care. We're in custom, normal mode. Sure, just. Let's change the Shrek here. Shrek here. Sport S. All right, you're on PS5s, and there it's cold right now, so easy on the throttle. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. I'll shut up so you guys can hear. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I was being nice and silent there. All right, I'll, I'll be quiet. Oh, that gauge cluster looks too much like an LFA for me to not get. <laughs> like this like, out. Like, yeah. Oh, it's just... It's what's the... It's, I, I'm triggered by it, but like it's a positive trigger. That's right, yeah. Is there well, a name for that? I don't know. You're just triggered because on the same day you spun out in a Ford GT. <laughs> oh. Like, I'm sorry. Yeah. Like, nothing else matters. Yeah. 
It won't let you go into first unless you're really slow. There it is. Lame. The ride is so good. It's very good. It's so good. It, it reminds me of... Uh, it's sort of got that same performance vibe where it's like the CT4 V Blackwing, where it's like, I got you, but also like, calm down, I got you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah, that yeah. softness, yeah. that extra level. Like, are you, are you in Sport Plus right now? I'm in just Sport. This is Sport Plus. Sport now, Plus. now that looks like an LFA. Yeah, now it's exactly like an LFA. So it doesn't rev quite as high. Um, is that, that even rev, louder? Might be, yeah. It might be. That revs high enough, to be honest. It's just the most charismatic engine on sale, I think, right now. Oh. That is just absolutely brilliant. Now we have drag raced one of these. It's not that quick. It's slower than the Supra. No, it, it's not, but it's like, it's, it's the definition of quick enough. Yes, 100%. It's the definition of it. And it's soft. Like, we, you know, we, we laugh about it being a dentist's car. Yes. It, it feels like it, it's made for an older crowd, but... <sighs> it's for the same reason we love the Bentley Continental. Like, why wouldn't you enjoy a soft, amazing-sounding, beautifully interior... Speaking of Bentley Continental, the interior of this car with this two-tone blue and white... Yeah. I... I it, it, it's basically my favorite interior right now in a sub $200,000 car. Yes. I don't think anything beats this. And it's worth saying that, you know, when it comes to like sportiness, it isn't as sharp or as buttoned down as a 911, which it technically competes with a 911. No, it right? isn't, but, but the ride is amazing. Like if you were going to actually grand tour in something, yeah. This has got to be top of the list for the price. I'm going to revise quick enough. I, it's quick. It feels quick. You know, it's not yeah. slow. No, it's not slow at all. But I mean, it's not like 911 fast. No. It isn't. And, and yes, $130,000 is a lot to stomach. No, it's but, not. But there's... No, no, no. When you think about it, when you think about the cost of things right now, this is a steal. Go on. But <laughs> this is a... You need to elaborate on no, that. This that's is a, a lot of money. Because, well, how much is a, is a Carrera S? Yeah, but they're expensive. If you compare this to an F-Type exactly R, they're expensive. compare it to an F-Type R. Sure, an F-Type R, Supercharged obviously. V8 also sounds incredible. I, but like, there's something about the way this is outfitted inside. Like even the way the rear seat belts yeah. have magnetic clasps. Little snaps. Yeah. It just, it's so put together. I you, love the design of the door. I love the design of the, the gauge cluster, the steering yeah. wheel. Someone who owns one of these isn't over leveraged or in debt. They have got their shit together. That's the, that's exactly what it is. Right. That's the vibe. Yeah, no, no. This there's a there's a confidence. Yes. To the to, to the to this Lexus. It's Owning funny, one yeah. of these is a confident thing. It says I've made 60 years of brilliant financial decisions, and I yes. know that this is less than one percent of my net worth. Mm -hmm. And yet somehow it's still an asset because the boys at Throttle House <laughs> have reviewed it well. <laughs> Thomas got out of this for the first time after driving it again, after reminding himself what it's like. And he said to me, why have I not spent my whole life trying to own one of these? And that's, that's the rose-tinted goggles of a car enthusiast. That's just what happens. Yeah. Your, your brain melts and you're like, you're like why do I own one? <laughs> <laughs> but the fact that this is a car that can do that and it wears a Lexus badge is just shocking to me. I, yeah, I, I mean, genuinely, they're a little bit too expensive on the used market. They're holding their value very well. Yeah. But like, if you said to me right now, hey, Thomas, would you daily this instead of your M2? I would go, yep. Yeah. Like, no question I would. This is a more, the steering, I think, is even better than my M2. This is actually a more fun, That's more charismatic though, car to drive than my M2. Yeah. Again, not difficult. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, whoa, hey, whoa, hey. No, seriously, though, I love this car, and I think it looks great. It sounds incredible. It's obviously well made. It's a Lexus, so you know you're not gonna have to worry about it. It's not small. Like if you're going for the convertible experience <laughs> and you want something. I love how you can feel the transitions and weights yeah, so well. It's great. Um, yeah, like a Boxster or a, even a 911 feels smaller, it drives smaller. It drives smaller, it drives lighter, it is lighter. But, but a 911 to me, it just, I'm sorry, I love them, but it screams boring. It just screams boring. This is not that. It's so not that. 
it's just such an interesting vehicle to, to exist today that you can buy this brand new right now. Seriously. It's, it's, it is, you're right. It's interesting. We drive a lot of things that sort of like deviate from the norm just ever so slightly. Yes. Like, well, this one's got six degrees rear wheel steering yeah. instead of four degrees. Yeah. This one genuinely feels different. It has its own flavor. 100%. I love, it, it I love this car. like the stuff you drink at the dentist that wash your mouth. <laughs> That's the flavor. That's the flavor. It is, and it, you know, I'm sorry to say about the IS500. This is another level. It is. In sound and it experience. Is. It is. Even though the IS500 has the same V8. Yeah. They've made this one. Well, the convertible helps. So would you get this as a convertible? No. Why? You, why? Because it still sounds amazing with the hard top and the windows down, and it looks so much better, and it's not a convertible. I'm that much less of a dentist. But you have a convertible. You love convertibles. Yeah, they're my little classic convertible. I don't want that in this. I want, this is, this is a, a, a car for driving long distances in style with a great noise and I want it to be as quiet and comfortable when I want it to be as I can. I don't want the soft top. Sorry, I pressed the button. <laughs> you did, yeah. <laughs> well, you were just talking about long distances. I was wanting to see what the fuel economy was. <laughs> see that. My next car is just going hard. There you go, 13.4 liters per 100 kilometers. Not that bad, not that bad. Fair Worth enough. it. Yeah, it's fine. Worth it. It's fine. I don't remember liking it this much. <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> it gets in, it's incredible to it's incredible to come back to this car after all the other cars we've driven in the last year and a bit. Yeah. And experience just it's so simple and and perfect at what it does yeah and, I, and it, the really the only issue we had was this was all very outdated yeah and now that that's fixed it's fixed like what is this like 100 grand us for this car some yeah give or take buy one buy one buy, yeah buy one buy even one. if you haven't got 100 grand just buy what just kind buy, of advice is buy that? one if you're a retired dentist buy one look nowhere else okay. there are some things at the price where you think it's would be a bit better. Like Harrison, our sound engineer, said that the Mark Levinson sound system isn't quite as good as other Mark Levinsons we've experienced. Also, the seats don't massage. They ventilate and they heat, but no massaging seats. If you're gonna go full luxury, I wanna be I... slightly needed in the back by a four-year-old. <laughs> <For some reason, laughs> gently needed in the back. Yeah. I don't know. That's I, about it, though. I, I honestly, like, those to me aren't good enough to be considered downsides, on, like, for the price and how much else you're getting. It just doesn't matter. I, I have a, a genuinely hard time crit criticizing it. I feel like the, the worst that I could say is that it could be a little bit sharper in the handling department. It's just soft. It's just for cruising. Exactly. <laughs> it's so good. Why is no one else making stuff like this? I know. No one else is making stuff like this because Toyota has deposited years of Prius fuel economy into the little bucket. So they're allowed to still continue making a V8 that's naturally aspirated, that's why. And now the Prius is cool. Yeah. That crack on the upshift is all day long I can listen to that. It's top two of my favorite cracks in the world. What's, no, don't tell me. <laughs> my R. 